Today is the first day we've got all the instruments here and we have the electronics here as well. And we basically have 10 days in which we need to put all of the composition together. I'm listening to the way Matthias phrases something on a particular instrument. And I'm listening to how Miles responds and what the potential of his response can be. And then actually integrating that into the composition rather than coming and saying, look, I want you to do this and just do it that way. Okay, cool, so running rattan. What I'm working with mostly is musical textures and timbres, which really means I'm working with layers of sounds or feelings of sounds rather than specific compositions like melodies and rhythms and you know a verse and a chorus that you'd hear in a lot of pop music. The point at which it becomes music and not just experimentation is, is actually a very difficult one to define. I think that good music has a sense of playfulness and creativity inherently built into it. So part of the playfulness and the exploration that we might hear in an improvisation is what I'd like to retain for the final performance. Elaine and I are really excited to be working with Tina McDonald. She's our fashion designer. How are you going? Good. Yes. Hey, hey. Hey. hey, Tina. How are you? We're working with her standard design, which essentially is modelled off a samurai costume. And we're all in white. The costumes we've specifically chosen as white, so that when they walk behind the glass, that there will be reflections on them as well. So in a way, they become the artwork. Can't do it. Good evening. <laughs> Looks better at the side, you Does it? Yes. It draws too much attention to the centre alone, it can't be a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even going to touch yeah. that one. <laughs> We've come into Fed Square tonight to install. Uh, we came in at 10 o'clock, mainly because we have to keep the thoroughfare clean during the day. So it means a late night, we'll probably be here from 10 till 6 in the morning. I think with me, on this occasion, where Showtech are coming in and installing, I guess, the basic structures before the glass is really hung. It's quite exciting doing what we're doing and I couldn't do it without help. I couldn't put scaffolding staging up and I can't get up and rock climb high enough to, to hang glass in you know, the areas that we want to. So for me, it's actually really exciting. That would be really cool. It's about 5.30 in the morning. It's been a really long night and uh, I actually expected to finish earlier, but it's dragged on longer. In another hour or so, I think we'll have knocked off the evening. I'm excited to see the, the glass installed in the space. It's the first time that I've had that entire body of work from seven years installed in one space. I think when people walk into the atrium area, it will be interesting to see how they react to the work. For me, the work is as much about the reflections of light as it is about the reflections of sound. 
It's not just about creating this calm, peaceful environment. It's about every muscle that you've moved to make it. I don't just look at that and think, oh, isn't that pretty? I just think of the movements that I make and I, I love that. Now that it's all up, I really just can't wait to see it being played. I think it's going to be exciting. Only a few hours to go before we start the show and I'm just doing the absolute final adjustments, making sure the instruments are in place and um, little details like cleaning the glass, checking the clothing's there and all those kinds of things. which is make music and have fun. I'm a little bit nervous, but not much. I'm, I'm confident. I know that once the show starts that I'll be, I'll be in the zone and it'll be, it'll be great. Do you want me to sort of tuck this in a bit? Oh, well, they'll fall down halfway through. But... You didn't want to get changed with everybody else? <laughs> I think like very cozy right? in here. Yes. We haven't had a chance to test the microphone right. with you guys up there, okay? Be really accurate so that whatever we get, we can do something with.
this is definitely one of the most interesting, um, engaging, and demanding in unusual ways um, of all the projects that I've done. I was really happy with everything. It was really what I was wishing for. So yeah, totally, totally right. My feeling is it's a lifelong journey for Eugene and I, and I would hope that if this is the infancy, it's going to be great.